Hi guys, welcome to my channel. This is Raj and this is 2024 Hyundai Santa Fe Hybrid. This is middle of the night and I'm trying to shoot this video so you guys can see how this car looks in the dark. So when you approach the vehicle, as you can see, it greets you. The door handle becomes pretty good visible. As you can see, the light is good there. So it means they recognize you. And then there is no other light comes on all around. So just only that one. Again, when I go close, the door handle comes on. When you put your hand, the light flashes and it comes on to the life. As you can see, it has a pretty good light all around inside. This is SEL, a four wheel drive model. Of course, it's hybrid and it does not have any ambient light. But again, it has pretty good light, as I said, all the buttons are backlit, as you can see right here. As you can see right there also, all these buttons are backlit, everywhere backlit. The lights inside are pretty cool. They're, they're on, I like the fact that on the third row, they're giving light on the both side. Sometimes you have only one in the middle, but not in Santa Fe. Now, let's turn on the engine and then see how it looks so as you can see it looks pretty cool right so do you really need ambient light maybe maybe not but it uh, really depends but in my case i don't care honestly speaking you know it does have enough light so when you're driving let's say and it gives you enough light all around as i said all the buttons are backlit and i like the fact that it has a light right here you know usually in this section, no other. I have not seen any other manufacturing given the light right there. That's really, really handy. And you do have light also right here, and, you know. And glove box, let's see. Should be, should be right here. So guys, as you can see, you have light all around. And I really like this fact, you know. Now let's check out the lights outside, how it looks. So as you can see, there's light on a turn signal, on a mirror, front lights, this is how it looks, the light bar and edge sign, you know, looks pretty sharp actually during the night. Let's go in the back. There's a light right here on the side, again, edge. And there is a brake light right here, but again, it's not engaged because, you know, nobody's braking it. And it does have two lights for the number plate, so, which is also unique because usually you get only one light. And this particular one is, as you can see right here, edge track hybrid. So yeah, this is how it looks in the dark. Now, uh, let's open the trunk and then see how it looks in the trunk. So again, these two lights, now the one was lighting up the number plate, illuminates outside the car because the trunk is open, which is good. And again, there is three lights in the trunk area. Two are on the top for the third row and one in the middle. And this big, this middle one is pretty big, pretty big, and it's pretty bright. And on the side, the only thing are, I guess, not the uh, backlit are these buttons to fold the second row, but that's that's okay. And there is a fan controller in the in the back seat. Let me turn it off, so you don't you don't need fan there. But as you can see, then you it's still a backlit. When you press the button, it turns on, and then it it shows you how much the fan speed is. You can control, you can rotate it, and you can shut it off. So yes guys, it does have, you know, pretty amount of lights everywhere and there is two buttons there. One is to just lock and one is to close the trunk. So I can either lock it or close it, of course, as you can see. Let me show you guys more about this car and this is how it looks when you lock it. This is how it looks when you unlock it. So you see, when you unlock it, this is how it looks, you lock it. It's done. So guys, if you have any other question, please let me know.